you're looking to make a repeater in Scrap Mechanic, this is how you do it. Across the bottom of the toolbar, you can see you need two logic gates. One, two. You need a timer. We need a switch. And we need a output. Now, for my purposes, because I'm in creative mode, there isn't actually a vacuum pump, so I'm going to use a light as my output just for you guys to see and i'll also set this up like this so you can kind of see how it flows now what we've got to do here is simply we need to have a loop so gate number one needs to be a nand gate gate number two needs to be an or gate and it is that easy then all we got to do is connect it up so we go in a loop we go from the NAND gate to the OR gate, from the OR gate to the timer, from the timer back round again. And then we have to take our output from the OR gate. As you can see, it's not even connected up to the switch. And it's going mad. We can turn the timer so it's nice and steady. There we go. So obviously that's just basic. If you just want to have it running, fair enough. That's as easy as that. If you want the switch, you just simply have to put the switch into the NAND gate. And now the switch is off. The circuit is on. Turn the switch. And then we have it flashing on and off. It's as simple as that, guys. Just to show you guys where you might use this in game, when you go to the packer and you've got to launch your items from your chest of course you need it set up so this is exactly how it was set up and as you can see if we flick the switch boom 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 it shoot it's nice simple easy repeater it's so far the minimal that i can find where you need two logic gates the timer and a switch and just set it up as you were shown hope you enjoy it guys